How good do these new rackets look? These are the brand new Metal Bone Control, Metal Bone Hard, and Normal Metal Bone from the Adidas 2023 collection. In this video today, we're gonna to be reviewing all of the different models, getting on court and testing them, seeing which one is best, and seeing what type of player would suit all of these rackets. Let's go. We're gonna test the Metal Bone Control first. This one is round, it's control based, it's got a big sweet spot in the middle. It's got low balance, so it feels more handle heavy. You could take the weights off and make it more head heavy. That's the point of these six customizable weights on it. It's got super strong carbon material on the surface. So imagine when you're at the net, you'll get a lot of precision because of the large sweet spot, but also because of the carbon, you're gonna get a lot of power and strength. Having said that, the core of it is soft. So comfort and control is gonna be high. Ideal, I think, from intermediate all the way to advanced level could use this. Maybe players that play quite a consistent game, but also wanna have have the power as well. The comfort's really nice, that's the one thing I noticed straight away, comfort is very good. The striking power is decent. The sweet spot is big. Like a few times I clipped it like high or towards the edges of the racket and I still didn't get the miss hits. I recommend you keep all the weights on. This is a very good racket for control and comfort. There's no need to take the weights off and make it more powerful. I think the balance feels perfect right now with the weights on. So this is the metal bone now, and this will be used by Ali Galan as well as he uses the metal bone hard in the World Paddle Tour. So this is a diamond shaped racket, it's high balance. The sweet spot on the racket is higher up on the racket to get more power. And again, super strong carbon material, but as well as the metal bone control, the core is also soft. So I'd say you get a good balance of power and comfort with this racket. And the customizable weights, if you remove these weights, you're gonna get even more power. If you keep them on, you're gonna get more comfort. I didn't mention about the surface. It's the same on all three of the rackets. It's rough. It's a shiny surface now, but it is still rough. You got like little raised bumps all over the racket. Defensively though, it feels good because again, the comfort is the same as the metal bone control. It feels just as soft, but you definitely have to hit the ball a bit higher up and it's almost, I feel like it's encouraging you to play a bit faster and hit the ball a bit harder, if that makes sense. All right, let's test some of the power on the metal bone. It feels like when you get a ball that you can kill, you can just go for it and it flies off the racket quick with a lot of spin as well. This is the metal bone hard now. This is the main racket that Galan uses. It suits his game perfectly because he's very aggressive and he has such a big smash. This is like all out power. Diamond shape, high sweet spot, high balance, so strong carbon, but also the difference with this one is the core is high memory. It's harder, it's firmer. That's gonna give you much faster ball speed. So the biggest question I get asked is what's the difference between metal bone hard and normal metal bone. The difference is that this one has a much firmer core, a high memory core, so it's all out power. Again, with this one, if you remove all of the weights, there'll be even more weight at the top. Basically, if you just want to smash the hell out of every ball, take all the weights off this, and you'll have probably one of the most powerful rackets on the market. I thought the last metal bone was powerful, so I'd be interested to see like the difference between that power and this power.
If you're an aggressive player, 100% use it. But I probably wouldn't recommend it for like players that like to play with loads of control and comfort. Players that want to just pressure the opponents, play super aggressive, push the opponents back, get a winner when they have the chance. This would be ideal. Which one is best? For me, I think the Metal Bone Control was best for control and comfort. And the Metal Bone Hard was best for all that power. And the Metal Bone was best for the balance of power and comfort. If I had to choose one to play with forever, I'd go Metal Bone Control. But if you guys watch this channel a lot, you know that I'm more of a control, consistent player. I'm not one to be really aggressive. If you've got any questions about these rackets, make sure to go on Everything Paddle and you can contact me on the WhatsApp button. And check out all of these rackets are available at Everything Paddle if you're interested. Thanks for watching.